What's up Woodford? We are here at Wild Side Winery. I'm joined with Miss Alicia Holt. We have a huge announcement. Yes, yes. And it is not that they got their solar panels, as you can see up there, but that is rather awesome. They are investing in this place. It, it is so cool. They're making so many cool improvements and you know, just being green and, and friendly to the environment, which is the whole purpose of all this acreage that you guys have out here. Absolutely. But Alicia, that's not a big announcement, it's is not, it? It's not, it's not. So it? today we want to talk about our upcoming, it is it is Versailles' first ever music festival. It's called the Wish Fest. It's going to happen here at Wild Tide Winery on August the 7th. Um, we have a great lineup coming. We're going to have two stages going. Um, we put a bunch of tickets out there on the market. Um, and what's cool about it is it's not just a music festival. It's also a uh, benefit to, um, to support a local Wish Kid, Wish Kid Ben. Um, wish could been uh, had a wish enhancement that he wanted. His his real wish kind of got thwarted by by COVID, and so he hasn't gotten to do those kind of things. Um, and so anyway, one of his wishes was his wish enhancement was to play with a band with a, a national somebody with national um, leverage um, on stage live. And so that's going to be um, the super awesome part about this. Wish Kid Ben is going to get to play drums. He's a drummer uh, on stage with Sunday Best during Wish Fest. That is incredible. I have cold chills just even thinking about it. So if you guys are not familiar, the Make-A-Wish Foundation obviously grants wishes for um, children who have been diagnosed with terminally or critically ill. And this is, um, you know, terrible diagnoses that these folks have gone through, just a, a path and a journey. Tell us about Wish Kids Ben's you know, his diagnosis and his path through his childhood. Absolutely. So at 13 years old, Wish Kid Ben was diagnosed with autoimmune hepatitis, which meant ultimately he was going to have to have a new liver. Um, he was able to get a new liver uh, pretty pretty recently. Um, and so so it's really exciting that, that he's going to be able to, you know, that those years, that the four or five years that he was um, not really able to live a normal teenager's life and to go out and do things. It's so exciting um, to be able to bring this cool thing to him that he can now do that most kids don't get to do. So so um, anyway, so yeah, so very exciting. He does he does have a new liver now, so that's wonderful news. And then also um, that he's going to get to do this whole thing. He's going to get to play his on stage dream, with Sunday Best, like such true. a big deal. Yes, that's <laughs> awesome. But you guys not only have, I mean, a great lineup in Sunday Best mm -hmm. and Wish Kid Ben, you know, serenading us on the drums. But you have a whole lineup of music. Absolutely, absolutely. So we're going to have two stages: one under the pavilion, another one back past our pawpaw trees. So the general public, I'm going to say, is probably never even seen that part of our farm so we're so excited um, to be able to use that for a first first time in a way that is really going to showcase this place so super duper exciting um, and so back there we'll also have a, a, a huge what you see at a traditional music festival stage um, and so we're going to have Sunday Best, Justin Wells, Laurel, Laurel Lewis, just all these different musicians playing. Um, also some of your local favorites, folks like Matt Castle and Trippin' Roots and High Five. Um, so we really have taken the best of all of it and put it all together in one really great event. So, so. say somebody is, I mean, we, you know, we all kind of have in our minds what a music fest is, but what's it going to look like out here at Wild Sun Winery? Um, well, I think we should, I think we should go look. Should we go see it? We ourselves? should, we right. should. We should hop on the golf cart and go check it out. Come on with us. food trucks over in this area so no need to bring a picnic that day um, we're gonna have food trucks and we're gonna have lots of great local wine and beer we also something else that's super cool we have partnered with mirror twin to create a special wish fest beer so they've taken if you folks are familiar with our bourbon blues they've taken a barrel of our bourbon blues after it was emptied so you still have the bourbon blues flavor in there and now remember bourbon blues is made in a bourbon barrel so it started as a bourbon barrel then it was a wine barrel now it's going to be a wish fest beer barrel and that will only be available day of show it's a very small batch um and, and so of course we'll sell out of that so yes. but it's going to be delicious they're making a sour out of it and so um your wine in the um it was with blueberries right mm -hmm. blueberries so it's our dry blueberry wine is what what the bourbon blues is so um but i just want folks to see we have this whole huge this huge space here um 
I've always envisioned ever since we took over the winery, um, what can we do with the space? How do we make the most of it? And so this is kind of the start of that in my head. So now of course we'll mow um, and, and have the place in, in pristine order so folks can bring their lawn chairs, they can bring their picnic blankets, um, and they can plan to just hang out for the entire day. So it starts at noon, it goes till 11 p.m. 11 p.m. Right? Uh huh. What? It, okay, so you, you can come out, you can eat your brunch, lunch, and your dinner because, like you said, you're gonna have um, food trucks. Mm -hmm. Do you have food trucks already lined up? You have a little yes, taste of yes, what yes. So definitely. <clears throat> And several other food vendors. Those are the ones that I can just name off the top of my head. Yeah. So that is awesome. This, I mean, this is picture perfect. Yes. How serene is this? And then you're gonna mm -hmm. have your music. Mm -hmm. Wish Kid Ben. What time will Wish Kid Ben? Okay, when, when will he go on stage? Well, so Sunday Best goes on stage at 9 p.m. on Saturday, um, and I'm not sure exactly. So we have a production guy. He would be the guy to ask that question to. So <laughs> we will make sure everybody knows because you're gonna want to get tickets. How if you're looking right now to go ahead and score a ticket because this thing could sell out. I think it's going to be rapid fire. Mm -hmm. How do you get a ticket? Um, so you can go to the Wildside Winery Facebook page and click in the event. It'll take you to Eventbrite or you can go to aidtheindustry.com and it'll also link you over to Eventbrite to grab your ticket. Only 40 bucks. I mean, where else can you get a, a full day of entertainment for 40 bucks? You so. can't even get one concert hardly. I, I know. You can't go to a concert for 40 bucks. Where, so. Okay, people want to stay. It's 11 o'clock at night. They mm -hmm. want to stay. Where do you direct them if they're saying, I'm coming in from afar and I'm going to try to... Um, actually, I've already had this question a couple of times. Folks, uh, uh, times the folks that I know from uh, where I grew up have messaged me and said, "Hey, Alicia, I got tickets, and I just saw this was your place." Um, so I'm sending folks to uh, the the Versailles Holiday Inn Express. So you don't have to stay in Lexington. You don't have to go that far away. I, I think when I looked, it's actually like 10 miles down the road. So yes. so it's a pretty good pretty good location to to, to stay that night. What um what kind of I mean obviously all your wines are gonna be flowing. It's gonna be mm -hmm. August. It's gonna be you know probably hot. Mm -hmm. What what's I mean, are we going to have some sangria pouches? Absolutely, absolutely. Okay. We're going to have our sangria, and I think we're kind of going back and forth. We haven't 100% decided, you know, we'll do pouches, but I also think we'll have just some regular sangria. We found some really some really fun tumblers that folks could purchase and, and get to take home as a souvenir. Um, so we're going to have those available um, for beer and sangria. And Show so anyway, your shirt while we're at it. Oh, yes. Yeah, so my shirt says, you had me at Merlot. Um, <laughs> this is brand new. It just arrived on site, and the reason we got this is because we're rolling out a brand new Merlot this year. Now, it won't be here in time for wish fest but um we're very excited to, to be adding merlot to our list of, of delicious flavors i love so. it i might just come camp out here one night are you okay <laughs> if you wake up and you see give me a couple of years and we'll and maybe we'll have camping at wish fest i don't know we'll see oh, i love it i love it but hey seriously in all in already if you're a harvest host member you can come mm -hmm. i mean maybe not for wish fest but just in general uh-huh tell absolutely. them about that concept absolutely so harvest host is a national organization they have about 1200 sites just like ours all small privately owned family style businesses um, if you join their membership which my understanding is about 80 bucks a year um, you can stay on any one of their sites across the country in an unlimited fashion for no charge all they ask you to do um, similar to what 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 uh, what harvest host asks you to do and similar to what we would hope you would do is to come in and buy a bottle of wine yeah. you know come enjoy the products that we have to offer so and why would you not want to I mean you, you know you park your rig and then... right yeah go check out the local space that yeah. you're that you're hanging out at but with 1,100 sites across the country, you can't you can't find a better deal than that. No, so. <laughs> that's awesome. All right, guys, August 7th, 11 or noon until 11 p.m. Mm -hmm. Sunday best. Wish Kid Ben. He's a local Wish Kid. Get on Wildside Winery's Facebook page or website. It'll link you over to where you can buy tickets. Grab your ticket today. Grab two. Do one for the whole family. 40 bucks. You cannot. You, you can't beat that deal. That's an awesome deal for a day's worth of fun. And it goes, obviously, for a great cause to support Wish Kid Ben and seeing his dream come true. Anything okay. else? Nope. I think that's it. All Just right, guys. Well, buy your tickets today. We'll see you August 7th out here at Wildside Winery. Bye.